Hello guys and my valued viewers, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Hopefully you are all fine like before, big news for Dinar just dropped. I always try my best to provide you the updated information. So this video is about the latest announcement of Iraqi Dinar news. Hit subscribe to stay informed and comment below. The recent praise from the Iraqi Parliamentary Finance Committee for Prime Minister Mohammed Shia Alabama Sudani regarding his commitment to increasing non-oil revenues reflects a positive shift in Iraq's economic strategy. Historically, Iraq's economy has been heavily dependent on oil exports, with fluctuations in global oil prices directly affecting the country's financial stability. By focusing on diversifying revenue sources and reducing this dependency, Iraq is signaling a move toward a more balanced and resilient economy. If al-Sudani's government successfully implements policies that foster growth in sectors such as agriculture, manufacturing, and tourism, this could have a profound impact on Iraq's economic structure in the long term. The recognition of his efforts by the Finance Committee indicates political support, which is crucial for the implementation of reforms that are often met with resistance due to vested interests or bureaucratic hurdles. The shift toward boosting non-oil revenues can have indirect effects on the Iraqi dinar's exchange rate. Iraq's currency value has traditionally been influenced by its oil revenues, as oil is the primary source of foreign exchange earnings for the country. When oil revenues are strong, they provide the central bank with the foreign currency reserves needed to stabilize the dinar. However, over-reliance on oil exposes the currency to external shocks. By diversifying revenue streams, Iraq can potentially create a more stable economic environment, less prone to the volatility associated with oil prices. Increased non-oil revenues could lead to a more sustainable budget, reducing the fiscal deficits that often require the central bank to intervene in the currency market. A healthier fiscal position strengthens investor confidence in the economy, which could lead to a more stable or even appreciating dinar over time. However, the revaluation of the Iraqi dinar is a complex issue that depends on many factors beyond just increasing non-oil revenues. For a revaluation to occur, the country would need a significant increase in foreign exchange reserves, improved economic fundamentals, and sustained political and security stability. While the efforts to boost non-oil revenues are a step in the right direction, it would take time for these policies to have a measurable impact on the broader economy and the value of the currency. In the short term, the dinar's exchange rate may remain stable or fluctuate based on global oil prices and domestic demand for foreign currency. But in the long run, a successful diversification of revenues could lead to a gradual strengthening of the dinar, especially if combined with other economic reforms such as improving the business climate, attracting foreign investment, and reducing corruption. It is also important to consider that while increasing non-oil revenues may positively affect Iraq's fiscal health, other challenges remain that could influence the dinar's value. Political instability, security concerns, and the ongoing need for economic reforms all play a role in determining investor sentiment and the overall economic outlook. For a revaluation of the dinar to become a reality, Iraq would need to create a stable and predictable economic environment where both domestic and foreign investors feel confident in the country's long-term prospects. The recognition of al-Sudani's efforts is encouraging, but it will require sustained political will, broad-based reforms, and a commitment to economic diversification over several years before any significant changes to the dinar's value can be expected. In conclusion, while the efforts to boost non-oil revenues are an important step toward stabilizing Iraq's economy and potentially strengthening the Iraqi dinar in the long term. The immediate impact on the exchange rate may be limited. Over time, however, a successful diversification of the economy could reduce Iraq's vulnerability to oil price fluctuations and improve its fiscal position, which would contribute to a more stable and potentially stronger currency. The path to revaluation is long and requires a combination of strong economic policies, political stability, and improved investor confidence, 